I worked overseas for a long time. There was a lot of bears and there's a lot of eagles and, and uh, you know, raccoons and, and you, I basically carved a lot of the, the wildlife from North America. I'm Cease Jones up here in the northwest of uh, New South Wales, up in a uh, little village called Carroll, and I am a woodcarver. You know, I've, I've done kangaroos and koalas and all Australian, Australian animals, but um, like there's a lot of favourites, a lot of people really like eagles and dolphins and owls and um, that sort of thing pretty much, you know. I like the uh, chainsaw sculpting because, well, you've got a raw piece of wood and and what comes out of it, out of a raw piece of wood, you know what I mean? Basically, what, whatever's in your imagination. And um, you can do it anywhere, pretty much. You can do it out in the middle of the forest somewhere and just carve up, you know, whatever you, whatever's in your head at the time. And um, pretty messy little job. <laughs> I do the profile method, which is you, you, um, I'll scarf one side, I'll draw in my profile, some people just do it raw, I'll draw in the profile, and I'll take out all that side profile, then I'll go around the back and I'll take the rear profile, so that's most of, you, most of your wood off. And then you go and you round it out and you start putting your shoulder, just say for a bear for instance, you start putting your shoulder in, work out where your shoulder is, work out where your elbow is, how you want your stance. If you want it stance, you want it angry, you want it, you want it sort of a whimsical, you know, you want to open its mouth, you want to put teeth in it, you want it looking up, down, sideways, and you um, basically work from there. It's an art form, pretty much, you know. There's a lot of, there's a lot of carvers that you know, do it with chisel and hammers and, and routers and all that sort, of, that sort of thing. It's just a, um, it's a different, another style of carving, pretty much. You know what I mean? Like with it, using the power saw. Use electric. I tend to use like a, a small 12 inch bar. And, um, and that seems to work for me. Some people use bigger, you know, bigger bars, bigger saws, and that sort of thing. But if you remember, you're hanging onto this thing for hours on end, and it gets a little bit trying. They asked me, uh, how do you carve a bear? I says, well, you take away everything that isn't a bear. <laughs>